Hello everyone, and welcome to my Sister Wives For You channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. One of the least popular cast members of Sister Wives, Robin Brown, has inherited some evil tendencies from her husband, Cody Brown. When Robin moved into one of the most well-known polygamous households, the drama escalated to the point where one happy family began to have problems. The head of the family, Cody, preferred Robin and her children over those of his other wives, Christine Brown, Janelle, and Mary. While Robin is clearly the beneficiary of Brown's separation, Cody is undoubtedly more responsible for exposing Robin's heinous qualities. Robin used to criticize her former sister wives a lot. Once during a confessional, Robin body shamed her ex-sister wives, calling them fat and ugly, before she succeeded in toppling Cody's previous wives and being the only one left. Robin, who was well known for her crocodile tears, frequently sobbed and said that all she wanted was a sisterhood, and that she was excited to live in harmony with her partner while continuing to be the catalyst for mayhem. By obeying all of Cody's rules without question, she was able to make him perceive his previous wives as disobedient. From the moment Robin appeared on Sister Wives, she has been a cunning and dishonest individual. She is incredibly cunning and lacks empathy in her heart. During Sister Wives Season 6, her true colors, how cold and calculated the star could get, came to light. During her purity speech, Robin expressed her sadness at having lost her purity to her ex-husband, David Jessup, and expressed that she should have saved herself for Cody. Robin gave Cody a locket as a token of her innocence. Robin shared Jessup in order to appease Cody, and it was extremely unsettling to witness her actions in front of her three kids. This comment may have influenced Cody's decision to adopt her three children because it made him feel better about herself when she accepted him and rejected her former existence. It might have also signaled the start of a conflict in the Brown household. When the sister wives reality star offered her love for him on a silver platter, she began to support Robin. Robin consistently expressed her desire to become a sister wife throughout sister wives. With her prior sister wives, Mary, Janelle, and Christine, she frequently insisted on developing real relationships and strong attachments. But Robin failed to meet her sister wives' objectives on several occasions. Robin elevated Cody on a pedestal when she joined the Brown family, something Christine, Janelle, and Mary did not do. Robin disclosed in the Sister Wives season 17 tell all how she turned became his ride or die. According to the reality personality, she kept her relationship with Cody tight by treating the father as her best customer. By treating their time together as a vacation and not grumbling to him like the other women did, the mother of five gained the right to be his first choice wife. Robin seemed laid back, and Cody began to take a special interest in her children. This eventually forced the other women to leave, making Cody, who had previously been polygamous, monogamy. Robin is domineering and frequently employs passive-aggressive methods to get Cody to comply with her requests. Cody was answering a fan's question at the Sister Wives. Talk back part two special when Robin interrupted him. Jeff, the commenter, said that it was fantastic that Cody and Robin had connected and that they have to take responsibility for their relationship. It was clear that Cody was not happy with his family's outcome, and he was about to say something hurtful. Robin told her husband to be polite while covering his mouth. Mary, Janelle, and Christine, the former original sister wives, reflected on their marriage to Cody and shared how they had prioritized the large family up until Robin and Cody's relationship started. The Brown family never regained their unity as a family after it, which had a significant impact on many things. Cody's partiality for Robin, particularly in the COVID-19 crisis, permanently shattered the Brown family. Mary, Janelle, and Christine believed that Robin and her kids received all the attention and resources, leaving hardly anything for the other people. Christine Via Brown, Tia, star of Sister Wives, is facing one of her worst challenges to date. 
she eventually managed to leave Cody Brown behind and start a new life. However, a recent development suggests that she may not get to see her grandkids for a very long time. To find out more, continue on. Christine Brown will terribly miss her grandchildren. Christine Brown's greatest love is for her children and grandchildren. She has expressed her gratitude for being able to visit her grandchildren frequently due to her proximity to Tony and Michael T. Patron. However, it appears like a change is on the horizon. Fans were notified online last week by one Redditor that Michael T. says season 19 will air in late August or early September plus Tony and Michael T. are moving out of Utah. After talking about a few of the topics that fans may expect to see in season 19, they continue to explore the transfer. The original post went on to say, Tony and Michael T. recently announced they are moving out of Utah to North Carolina, presumably near where Maddie lives. They had just begun packing and listing their home for sale. Christine is very sorry that they are relocating, but she still supports them. Although they haven't explained why they're moving, they want to talk about it in upcoming videos. What caused the patrons to relocate? Being a highly involved grandma, Christine Brown will undoubtedly be completely shocked by this. While some Redditors expressed sympathy for Christine, others speculated that the patrons' decision would portend a sister-wise spin-off. Since the family is no longer polygamous, they no longer truly qualify as sister-wise. Reddit users posted, To me, it seems to be screaming spin-off. If the show goes on, what options are left to them? It cannot have the same structure or conflict. Yes, that is possible, but that would be difficult to accept. This might be a more wholesome spin-off for them, in my opinion. This wouldn't be a secret if the relocation was just to allow the cousins to be together. Therefore, something greater has to exist. Work, an offshoot, or simply misinformed content. Gasp. Perhaps this is the first indication that the program is about to terminate. If the cameras were still going to be recording, Michael T would not miss an opportunity to leap in front of them. Who else would be the loyal daughter without her? Besides, fans have previously conjectured that Janelle might relocate to North Carolina in order to be nearer to Maddie and Caleb. Should she do so, it is possible that Christine and David may also travel to the East Coast. Regarding Tony and Michael T's choice to go to North Carolina, what are your thoughts? Will Christine Brown go there to spend time with her grandchildren in the future? Post your thoughts in the comments section. To stay up to date on the newest Sister Wise news, visit TV shows Ace Online. For additional information and updates regarding Season 19, check back soon. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.